If you easily find things disgusting, turn away. I'm pretty sure that's not how you do it. So ugly, I could kiss it. Ew, 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 ew. What's up you guys? Welcome back to Clever Style. Yeah. If you are new here, you clicked on this video, so I already know you like feet. Today, we are going to try that weird thing that like shouldn't exist, but maybe is really cool. I pray that you are not easily grossed out. We are talking about phalanges, AKA feet, AKA Barney Rubble feet. If you're my mother, you know how they used to drive cars and they ran with their feet? That's what she said my feet look like. Damn! I know, she's cold blooded. But listen, today we are talking about foot face masks. So the baby foot peel was pretty popular, pretty viral a few years ago. Well, it has made a resurgence on TikTok and the results look insane. So we thought, why not try foot face mask on our feet and see what the outcome is. There is nothing better than getting a really good long skin peel. It just comes right off. I'm just a little nervous that I'm showing my crusty feet to the world. It's a little nasty, but uh, here goes nothing. I have a lot of strong feelings about so many things. My feet are not one of them. So here's the current foot situation. Ooh, my lips match my toes. It was not intentional. Here are my phalanges, and I definitely lotioned up for you guys, because if you ever watched a clever video, Drew and Emil have ruthlessly come after my feet for being ashy. You know she don't lotion her legs. Ooh, Jackie, you hear what? that? He threw some major shade at you! What? So uh, I do have like some calluses, like not super bad, but I have calluses here, calluses here, uh, calluses on the side. They look pretty dry, but not to the point where I have started. It's not picking season yet. My problem areas are definitely around like the toe and the heel. It's a little rough back there, a little hard. When I get a pedicure, I normally ask them to, you know, kind of scrub that area. There's this like really chunky hard part right here that I usually peel. And then right here, this gets so thick of hard skin. I'm just hoping this will get a lot softer and this will get a lot softer. I'm very curious to see if this foot peel actually like gets into where my like calluses are. All right, so here is the foot pill mask. Um, so the one that everybody was using on TikTok was sold out everywhere. So we tried to get something that was super close to the one that people are using on TikTok. Exfoliating treatment with 24 karat gold, argan oil, aloe vera, vitamin A and E. Instant skin renewing, moisturized, nourished and soft skin in one hour. This is gonna peel my skin off in an hour. Is it made of acid? Say what? I've never used this. I've seen videos, however, and it's crazy. Your feet literally peel for like two weeks. If it's gonna give me baby soft feet, then cool. There is acid. Okay, there's a couple different acid words in here. Must leave it on for an hour. Oh, I see. You leave it on for an hour. Like what does 24 karat gold do for your feet? I know they put that in like primers and you know, all like these like toners and stuff. I love Gold. This foot peel mask can remove dry, cracked, callous skin without causing any pain. Why wasn't this around when I was a kid? Remove nail polish, wash, and dry your feet. I'm not removing my nail polish. Why is that important? I do have like one little blister from like my running shoes. I wonder if I should put a bandaid over it. Okay, so I just washed my feet. Open the booty and Place your feet inside. These, <laughs> if you have a big foot, it's gonna fit in here. How do I open them? I don't know. What the hell do you open this? Open. Why am I struggling? Is this, this seems something's off. I just like straight up just like tore it open. I'm pretty sure that's not how you do it. Oh God. It smells like chemicals. Oh God, that smells so strong. Wait, so where are the booties? They're inside. So I'm gonna put this on my foot now. Oh, gross. Secure booties with attached adhesive tape. Okay. I'm pretty much just gonna put a sock over this because there was something around here that was sticky that I ripped off that I mean, technically you were supposed to tighten it like that with the adhesive, but I ripped it. Like that? 
This isn't sticky at all. What am I supposed to do with you? I mean, they're not going anywhere. Neither am I. Place a pair of socks over the foot peel sock and leave on for the duration of the treatment. This feels so wrong. <laughs> uh, okay, it's in there. Need some socks. Bear back. Kind of burns. Oh, it's slippery. Oh, don't walk in them. Ah! It feels so gross. Like. I don't really know how to explain it. It feels normal because I have socks on, but then it's like all sticky and gooey, gooey inside. Got my booties in my booties. Everything is on, everything is secure, and now I just gotta, I get to just go kill time for an hour. I don't know what to do. While I wait for my feet, I decided to learn some TikTok dances. <laughs> Been 20 minutes. My feet feel very goopy. And I just found out it has been 17 years since Hillary Duff released Come Clean in 2004. This is how I'm spending my hour doing ASMR with my feet. Tell me that sound is not satisfying. So it has been an hour. You know when you're in a jacuzzi for a very long time and you feel like your feet are pruning? Damn! That's exactly what this feels like. Let's take these off. Ugh. Ooh, they can breathe. Well, they're very slimy. They feel nice and smooth. They're not pruny, but they feel like it. Then rinse, mask off, washing feet. Moment of truth. Interesting. Okay, it does look like the, the tougher parts of my foot. They look the most different. Like it does look like something has already begun to happen. Oh my gosh, look, it's already starting to peel. That is crazy. They don't feel so softer, but they're peeling already, which is crazy. It wants to shed. I have a feeling that my feet are going to be shedding like crazy over the next couple of days. I thought maybe my toenail polish would come off, but it's still there. Like the roughest parts of my skin, they're gonna come off. They're gonna have fun peeling off. But it really, ugh. <sighs> All right, well, I'm gonna wash my feet again because this smell is pretty, unappealing, and then I'll check back and see if we've got any action, any foot action. Three days later. It has actually been three days and nothing was happening. And as you can see, my foot is definitely starting to peel. It looks like I've been running through some dirt. There's some like leftover residue that's not dirt, that's just like dead skin falling off. Look at this toe, ew, 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 ew. My foot is not peeling, but it is like really wrinkly. Like it looks like it has aged. Maybe my feet are so tough that they just need a little more time. It is day four of the foot peel. And what I have found is that every time I get out of the shower, um, and I like wipe my feet, that's when my foot starts peeling. It's not exactly like the TikTok videos that I've seen where the skin just kind of pulls off, but if I took a scrubber to this, all of this would fall off. Like, like look at that, ugh. I would recommend if you don't want skin just trailing all over your place in your home to scrub your feet while you're in the shower. A lot of that dead skin will come off in there versus it just peeling and coming off dry. So I would scrub to get most of the skin off. Okay, so it has now been six days and we're not peeling. We're, we're a little like crusty, but I'm not getting like the good layered flake of skin peel. Like if you love peels like I do, this would not satisfy. It's still like crackly. If anything, they just look way more dry than they were to begin with. See how dry it is right there? Um, but it's not quite peeling. As you can see, now my foot is starting to peel. Like before it was like almost just like crumbly. Now it's like the skin is like for real peeling off. Mostly on the heels that's happening. Let me pull up my other foot. Yeah, as you can see, 
It is definitely shedding a lot of skin. Ew. Ew. Honestly, I'm really disappointed. I was so excited to do this, to have my foot peel, to really share that experience with all of you, to let you know that um, of all of my, my assets and my skills, it's okay if my feet are crusty and weird and I pick them, you know? I can't, I can't be perfect. I just have gross feet right now. Uh -huh. Grosser feet, I guess I should say. I think it's gonna take a while for it to shed. It's already been five days. We're almost at a week mark and my foot is just slowly disintegrating and peeling away. I think I really needed it. I think my callus on the back heel has been the most improved. It definitely does work. The process is disgusting. If you don't have anywhere to go, anywhere to go, definitely recommend. But if you have like a beach vacation that you're planning, Definitely don't do that a week before or two weeks before. Do it maybe like four weeks before and you'll be good to go. Maybe my feet were so hard that I was supposed to use the foot thing longer and even maybe use it twice. Even though I didn't get to live out my peel dreams here today, there's always hope for the future. Holy crap, breaking news. My foot is disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. We're about to get some good peelage up in here. <sighs> this is a trigger warning if you, if you easily find things disgusting, turn away. It's so ugly, I can kiss it. Oh, we're gonna get some good skin peels up in here. Oh. Okay, it's a little baby peel. You know, we're starting small. I'm gonna put this in my pile. Oh. It's, it's interesting, there's no peelage up here, which is the part of my foot that I usually love to peel because it's, this is where all the calluses are, like here and here. All the peelage happened in the softest part of my foot, so maybe this requires, you know, medical intervention. You know, when I agreed to put my feet on the internet, I thought I was going to get this, and I did, it delivered. My feet are still peeling, and I think from what I've seen online that it's gonna continue to peel for the next couple of weeks. As far as like baby smooth feet, it's it's not happening. If you're solely depending on this foot mask to give you these baby soft feet, I don't think that's gonna happen. Maybe it just didn't work for me and it'll work for someone else. Oh, look how gross that is. Damn! My foot skin is as white as my bathtub. I think we made a lot of good progress here. It's like snowing in my bathroom. I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, please comment a foot so that I know that you are as weird as I am, as we are, because Jackie agreed to do this too. Good luck on your baby foot journey. I gotta get back to work, okay? Thanks, bye.